Good afternoon, it's Tony again from Farm Investigation UK. Today's date is the 3rd of um, February 2022. And we're now uh, continuing with the Chester investigation, we're now on the 17th of August. Um, a question that was asked me recently is regard to are all the, the footage considered to be paranormal? Yeah. What tends to happen is, that if, if I'm absolutely certain that, that it's got a rational explanation, such as somebody's walking uh, through a door or um, an insect, that type of thing, or a sound that we can certainly, a cleaner, for example, using the hoover, they just go into the, the negative folder. And it's probably approaching around about 300 of those. I'm not going to do reviews on them. It's, it's pointless. But I, I dealt with one typical one. I do go through each one in detail. So, for example, this one's in the main office. You can see that flash of light come down. Okay, so you would have seen me do this before I set the difference. I'll fast forward and I've actually done it in advance for you. So I've slowed it down and it's clear that it's just dust or that has got the potential of maybe a spider's web type of thing. Uh, and what will happen, I'll keep all that, I'll put it into a folder, which is useful to do like a, you know, dust and insect of the year type of compilation video. And that one goes into the negative folder. So this uh, away from uh, the rest of it. So I just thought I'd quickly cover that, is that we deal with considerable numbers of um, footage from this building. They do have a rational explanation and we do take as much care with those as possible. But if, they, if we're absolutely 100% certain that it's got a, uh, an explainable reason, then we'll just simply pop it into the uh, negative folder and move on to the next one. So I just thought I'd quickly cover that. Around the 17th of August, um, I've gone through a couple of these, and this is going to be a complicated one, uh, because there's eight of them. Uh, I've had quite a, a long debate with the owner over this, because um, this covers the same camera as what we had the other day when we had problems with it. Um, let's start the first one up, and I'll show you exactly what it is that I mean. So the, the sensor light tends to come on and is followed by this crack sound. Once the infrared light, because the infra, infrared is on there, because what ends the day, this is it, half past day, it's just coming about dusk, isn't it? Infrared's on, sensor light comes on and we go colour. That's what's happened there. You've got this weird sound. I can also hear the, di the distance of car starting up and moving away. That's got to have a rational explanation. I think the camera uh, is damaged. That's the 17th. Um, and we had a similar issue there. On a, 10 days earlier on the 7th. Where the cameras, mi I still think this camera is misbehaving. Um, so the way that we'll work with this is we'll quickly th go through the model, um, and then I'm going to pop them into Mixcraft and find out if the audio is still causing problems. Where it was going to, it was seen to be recording audio at forty seconds, then it just stopped. It carried on filming. Uh, but the audio just went to stop. But you can normally hear this when it when it occurs. So we're just going to spend probably exactly eight minutes going through all these. So let's give this a go. I can still hear in the the background.
come to the point where the other's audio stopped. And it does again. Stops again. You can hear that. I'll just go back a few seconds. The audio goes off. There has to be something wrong with the camera. Sound. Crack. For some reason, the sensor light only stays on for a couple of seconds and goes out and the camera then switches to infrared. The infrared stays on. Uh, the, uh, the audio stayed on on that particular one. Since the light only just stayed on for a second. Um, Okay, come to the next one. The audio stays on on that one. Uh, I think the audio is going to go off on, on this one because that's the same cracker we heard before. This is the same camera that's happened over a couple of weeks. Okay, it's now around about 40 seconds, 42 seconds. There you go. Sound's gone off again. Okay, is that video? Okay. It is a little bit strange. Uh, for some reason, the the IR hasn't completely. See, you don't seem to be quite as bright as before. Audio. This time stays on. This is it, half past nine on the seventeenth. Next video. I th right, okay. Um, I can hear rumbling the car outside. 
I think this audio is going to um, switch off. There you go. It just happened to, it's when this loud crack happens, the audio goes off. When it just happens, the audio seems to record all the way through. So that's 2127. It's about an hour later. I think the audio will go off on that one as well. This is 2224. way I'll work with this, I will record all this up separately after this review and I will send it over to a colleague and ask her to give me a report back on this. I don't tend to give pointers for it neither, just to get an honest opinion back. Um, there you go, audio goes off on that one. This one's 23.42. I'll, I'll bet your bottom dollar the audio button on this one. It's fast forward this time. There you go. This is back to earlier. Okay. So, so uh, I can I consider all eight of those to be suspect. Um... I think there's something wrong with the camera. Um, there's something going wrong a bit, a bit, a bit strange with it because when there's a loud crack, the um, actual um, audio stops at around forty seconds. Um, that can be paranormal. So. Um, I'm actually going to put this onto YouTube um, because I'm actually going to write this up, one up so if anyone, you know, at some point in time in the future, because the volumes you give to other parapsychologists and investigators to, to review and look at, they may find some usefulness in, in that. So I think it's important that we, rather than just dismissing them, saying something wrong with the camera, um, I'm 90% certain there's something not quite right with it because it's happened so to before. It's not like a one-off event there. And I'll also include the um, the, the review, uh, the opinion of, a, of another colleague. So, um, right, that's it for movie 365. Quite a lot of writing to do on this one. But on, on movie 366... Uh, may not be today, but um, I will cover that in detail uh, and go back over that to show you exactly what it is that I've done and the recording procedure that I've used. Okay, see you soon. Bye.